story tonight. We have details on the school bus accident in Houston County that left a six-year-old child dead and several others on the bus in the hospital. 41 NBC's Joy Dukes joining us in the studio now with more. Michael, it's heartbreaking to imagine a six-year-old having his or her entire life ahead of them, riding the bus home from school as they would any other day, only to have it all cut short so suddenly. But that's exactly what happened Monday evening. Um, it's a, a, a very heart-rendering situation out there. A Houston County school bus full of children that never made it to their homes. Yesterday at 411 in the afternoon, officers were dispatched to Forest Park Drive, which is between North Pleasant Hill Road and MacArthur Boulevard in reference to a serious injury accident. The bus carrying around 39 children from Westview and Pearl Stevens Elementary was traveling down Forest Park Drive on a steep curve when police say it tipped over and landed on its side. A child was ejected from the vehicle. Um, that child was critically injured and was transported to Navicent and Macon. Suzanne Jimenez is a mother herself. It's like hard to lose a child any age but six. She's still a baby. And a resident in the neighborhood who says she avoids taking Forest Park Drive. It's really steep and it's a lot of curves and people going through too fast. Chief John Wagner with the Warner Robins Police Department says this is the bus's normal daily route. So they're not exactly sure what could have caused it to overturn. My understanding is that that is a regular route for the bus um, every day. So uh, it's, it wouldn't be a surprising for the first time to, to negotiate that curve, come, come through that way, not by any means. But the accident hit close to home for residents and first responders. Um, all those officers and first responders that were out there, many of them have children. And um, to see that uh, happen to any child, it's, it's really uh, heartbreaking for them. And, um, and they carry that um, with them. Chief Wagner says the school district has been very cooperative with the investigation. Houston County Schools did release a statement from the superintendent about the accident and the victims. The student killed was a first grader from Parkwood Elementary School and the bus driver, Shalita Harris, had only been employed with the district since October of 2017. Superintendent Dr. Mark Scott's statement reads in part, our thoughts and prayers are with this family during this sad and difficult time. We also offer condolences to our Parkwood students and staff members, especially the child's classmates and teachers. Michael? Well, the driver and five other children with minor injuries were taken to the Houston Medical Center. No charges have been filed and no other cars were involved in the accident. The Warner Robins Police Department's Traffic Division is still investigating. To view that full statement from the superintendent, head to our website, 41NBC.com.